You know, when you think of the University of Tennessee, you probably think of the obvious, right? Neyland Stadium, yep. the Vols, the Power T, and of course, tradition. All those things. And one of the things steeped in tradition near campus is Cumberland Avenue, known as the Strip. <laughs> this area is evolving pretty much every day. Yeah, it seems like it. Six on your side reporter, uh, Dominic Webster, joins us here live in the studio after speaking with UT students about the changes along Cumberland. Dominic. Bo and Lori, Cumberland Avenue, affectionately dubbed the strip by students and alumni, over the course of a year, a dramatic change has taken shape, where popular eateries and nightlife establishments once stood are now turning into apartment buildings to accommodate the continued growth of the University of Tennessee. With the current enrollment of more than 36,000 students, finding a place to live is hard to come by. These new apartments should alleviate some of those housing woes and may even solve an on-campus problem. Definitely make it easier for people on campus for parking, especially, I'd say, because I think all these apartments are going to have garages in them, so people won't have to go to commuter lots as much if they live across the river and stuff like that. But I'd say it definitely would make parking much easier. One thing Bunch did say is that the traffic may become more of an issue as more and more people move to the Strip. As someone who lives right near the Strip, Bunch said with all the current construction, it's made it difficult for him to get to and from his apartment on Lake Avenue due to road closures in the area. It can be tricky, that's for sure. Yeah. Dominic, thank you. You know, as of now, the hub on campus is expected to open in the fall of 2025. Other projects will follow in the years to come. Coming up tonight at 5, we'll hear from another student on how this new development may be taking away from the nightlife that called Cumberland Avenue home.